Barakatha Yahweh, Barakatha Yahweh Shah, Barakatha Yahweh, Barakatha Yahweh Shah. I want to give all praise to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shah, Bashem, Rakakadash. I want to give double honors to the elders and the apostles and great millstone and Barak of Thumb to you brothers decided to teach this truth with faith and sincerity throughout the four corners of the earth, okay? And uh, I'm going into this article that's on uh, Euronews.com and it's, uh, the title is uh, Will Microchip Implants Be the Next Big Thing in Europe, Man? Okay, and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and read. It says thousands of Swedes have been pioneering the use of futuristic micro microchips that are implanted under the skin of the head. The technology is used for everyday tasks like assessing your smartphone, opening the front door, or setting an alarm. And uh, for you people that's been living under a rock or something. The RFID chip is the mark of the beast chip, man. Is the mark of the beast, rather, I should say. Okay? This thing is going to be implemented worldwide. And then it goes on to say, those behind the microchips, the size of a rice grain and implanted via a syringe, pierced, Okay? Are working to access other parts of Europe because this thing is going to be uh, implemented worldwide, man. Okay. And I'm gonna go down. Okay. <laughs> and then it goes on to say, uh, <laughs> it is a step towards the future, and that's right, man. Because this <laughs> this thing is going to be implemented worldwide. Okay, and it's it's not gonna happen. You know, it's it's gonna happen extremely close right now, man. We we coming into these times where Yahweh Shai is gonna come back, man. We coming into these times where all hell is gonna be released on America, man. Okay, then it goes on to say we are seeing that a lot of people in Italy are not happy with adding GPS or something that can track our movement that might be danger for us. He <laughs> that might be danger for them, man. Because with this whole COVID-19 situation and uh, these big corporations allowing you to be tracked via phone and, and apps that you have on your phone, People were, were were highly upset about that, man. So they saying with this chip, they gonna be able to get, be able to be tracked even better. But Esau's trying to, you know, he's trying to say that you won't be able to be tracked. You won't be able to be tracked with the chip because it's a a near field NFC near field. Uh, I forget the exact. Uh, acronym it stands for but it can't be tracked okay unless uh you're very close into proximity with whatever you're using or whatever okay but you can't trust esau man you cannot trust esau man he is the devil that the bible speaks of man Right now, Esau got shit set up to where he's tracking you on your phone right now, and you don't even know it. Your phone could be off, zero battery, and it's still, <laughs> it's still tracking you, man. You you can't trust Esau. You can't trust anything that that devil says, man. Okay. And uh, this is what I really want to get right here, man. <laughs> And it's in bold, okay? It says, removing the need for a wallet, man. Why? Because this chip is going to be your means of buying and selling. When they implement this thing worldwide, this chip will be your means of buying and selling, man. And you won't be able to buy or sell unless you have the chip, man. Okay? 
It says, uh, Swedish IT solutions planner Martin Lewin uses the two microchips in his hand for things like logging into his computer, setting the office alarm, and launching his LinkedIn profile, okay? But using them as an alternative to cash or card payments is expected to be the tipping point <laughs> for the technology, man. This is beautiful right here, man. It's no different than just removing it's no different than just removing the need for a wallet removing the need for a keychain removing the need for all these disconnected tokens that only create risk because if you lose them you lose your identity man and what they want to do man they, they want to put those chips inside of you that has everything that 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 there is to know about you inside you on that on that microchip man They want to remove all these, uh, you know, what they view them as uh, disadvantages, I would say, and, uh, and, 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 and turn them into a convenience, man. You got your keys. You got your goddamn uh, credit card. Okay, you got your, uh, your, your ID, your identification. You got it all right inside your hand, man, and they want to look at that as a convenience, man. But really, <laughs> the most high is going to, man, is going to smite you for taking that chip, man. Because when you take that chip, you bow down to Esau, man. You bow down to these elite banking families, and, and, and you say that they're God, man. Because that's what Esau plans on, wants to do with this chip, man. He wants to make it mandatory worldwide everyone is gonna you know everyone is gonna have to get one of these chips so why so esau can track you man so esau can track everything you do from what you buy to what locks you're opening in to where you're going you won't be able to pick your nose okay so much as without esau knowing about it man okay and uh, I'm going to go and get some scriptures. Yeah. Okay, this is uh, Revelation chapter 3 and verse 10. Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I will also keep thee from the hour of temptation. And the hour of temptation is when that microchip, is when the RFID chip is made mandatory upon the earth which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth, man. And if you go into that word uh, try on the Strong's definition, it's through the idea of piercing, man. And what are you going to get pierced? You're going to get pierced. You're going to get that tip pierced via syringe into your hand, man. And, uh... I'm going to go to Revelations chapter 13, and verse 16, okay? And he causeth all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive the mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. And, and Lord willing, I'm going to do a video on, uh, on um, Neuralink, Elon Musk company, because he just uh, released... He just did a live on YouTube, okay, explaining uh, what that uh, chip is basically a chip with a bunch of wires that's going inside your brain, and he's basically explaining what it's going to be able to do, and this is uh, verse 17, and that no man might buy or sell save he that had the mark of or the name of the beast or the number of his name, man. So you're not going to be able to buy and you're not going to be able to sell when this thing is made mandatory. Okay? <laughs> and all hell is going to be breaking loose in that day, man. So that's pretty much all I want to go into on this lesson. I want to give all praise to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Kakadash. I want to give double honors to the elders and the apostles and Great Millstone. And salawam to the hopefully elect.